There's one more thing I want to show you in Microsoft Word, and that's how to track changes. And um, I've got a, a legal document here I'm going to open up. Previously, you could always track changes, but it wasn't easy to track changes. So if I now go into review, and on this legal document, you see at the top here, when I move the mouse uh, uh, across the top, I can click on this, and the color of it changes. And that tells me that I want to tra track the changes on this document. Now, this document is for a reseller agreement, and I want to stipulate that the reseller agreement is for Europe only. Now, when we come down a couple of pages, it says about the territory, and I'm going to enter in territory just in here. Okay, so I'm going to put in here that I stipulate it's in Europe. That's where I want it to go. And any changes to this document are going to be tracked. What I'm going to do now is I exit it, and it goes now to our, our legal people, and Raila's going to look at it. And she's going to make any changes if she wants to. Let's see what changes you've made. Europe. I don't think so. My product sells worldwide. There you go, back to you. Okay, all right. Now I'm going to go back and open the document again, the reseller agreement demo. Remember in review, we, we checked track changes. And if I come down, if I remember it was at the top of page three, And what we should do, we should notice quite brightly if any changes have been made to this document since I sent it to Raila. And there we are. We can see now where I wrote Europe, it's been crossed out. And uh, it shows me that Raila's now written in worldwide in there. And there are the changes that have been made. Let's just zoom in so we can see that clearly. And we can see the changes that have been made to that. And that sticks out very clearly above the black font of everything else. Now also on that, if I'm not so keen on that and I want to write a comment on it back to her, I can insert a comment. And I want to write, perhaps I want to write in here, in my little comment that she's, that she's put worldwide, I might want to say, this was not my intention and now literally I've got the comment saved in there I can exit that exit that I want to save the changes and that's done that's how to track changes in a, do in a word document not particularly a, a different than 2003 but I think much easier because now you can find it in the in the in the uh, ribbon and also you can check the box and and really get again ease of working with office 2007